Man gang, what's the damn deal? Man, now I, I uh, pay Will. You know, I looked at you at uh, South by Southwest. Yep, fucked around. Got one in. Right, definitely. But Ben Gang Biggs. Ben uh, unfortunately, Biggs. you know, you wasn't there. <laughs> Mazo, unfortunately, you wasn't there. Uh -huh. Why is that? Man, I had to handle some business here. I was trying to get there, but I had to handle some important important business here first. I tried to leave, but I, it wasn't going to be nothing. It wasn't going to be in time, so I had to stay. All right. Now, Biggs. What's up with it? You on house arrest, right? All right. Can we speak on that? Yeah, we can speak okay, on that. Okay, how did all this come about? Man, fucking around with some lame ass fraud shit. So, y'all out there, make sure y'all don't do that shit. For real. Yeah. Stay away from that shit. That shit ain't good for you. Now, when we speak, you know, fraud, is you talking like, what is it, credit card? Like, what yeah, is You know that dumb shit, man. Yeah. I ain't fuck with that shit. <laughs> yeah. So, can you speak on, like, how you got caught up or? Well, I was driving, got pulled over. And shit, it was just like that. Okay. So you got pulled over, did, you got arrested. Right. And did you have a bell? Did you have a bell? Like, uh, yeah, I got a bell. <coughs> See my shit beeping right now. Okay. Low battery, recharge unit. Real nigga blues, you know. You know. <laughs> Real nigga blues, you know. All right, so wait, so you get arrested, then what? Shit, I got arrested, went to jail. I was in that bitch for about two or three days, and they let me out that bitch on a writ, thousand dollar writ. Some shit my lawyer set up, got me up out that bitch, came home. They came back to get me about a year later. So shit, and that's why I'm on house arrest now. Okay, how long you on house arrest for? Shit, I've been on this bitch for nine months, mm. and now I just gotta go to uh, court next month and get sentenced. Okay, so. You don't know, You could. they could put you on probation. They could put me on probation. They could give me a mandatory two years or they could put a 46 months on top of the two years. Yeah. So, shit, we don't know what we looking at right now. Pray now, for the best. Yeah. Right now, going through this such, going through this situation, is, is this something that you think about every day? Yeah, yeah, man, I'm stuck. And they only give me five hours out the crib, so shit, I'm in this bitch all day. Yeah. You feel me? 19 hours out the day, so shit. Just fucked up for me right now, but my bro's holding it down, pay, drop a CD at the city, Mazo and this bitch with me every other day working, so you know, we gonna get it. Yeah, so, I mean, but of course this is better than, than being in jail, though. You know what yeah. I'm saying? You can still shoot videos, you know, you can still do, you know, a lot of the stuff that you can't do in jail. Right. So shit, just hopefully they let me out this bitch. My man's Rose in that bitch right now, AJ in that bitch, I talk to them every day, so. Just hopefully they let us out this shit, man. Like, there's everybody make mistakes, you feel me? Yeah. So shit, hopefully they let us up off this shit. Right now, when I interviewed y'all in March, they was asking, you know, where's Mazo? You know, uh, a lot of people was upset y'all wasn't, you know, in that interview. They thought I was forgetting about y'all. Yeah. But it is a lot of y'all in band gang, though. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? I get, I get y'all names mixed, mixed up and messed up all the time. Um, <coughs> and, and like I asked y'all in the first interview, like, it's so many y'all in band gang. Like, how did... How, how do y'all plan on marketing yourself when there's no Michael Jackson or the other group? Oh, man, that's easy, man. We know how to all, we all got a part in this shit. You feel me? We all use our brains together. So it really ain't no like no Michael Jackson or nothing of the group because we all need each other the same way. You feel me? We don't, we, we, we help each other out tremendously. Yeah, yeah. You feel me? So that's why it don't come upon being no lead you feel me person in the group because we help each other out a lot you yeah and, and, and i speak with you know uh you know affiliates of y'all and they say you know y'all y'all each have your own time where one's buzzing more than the other yeah it just be like it go to like motherfucking pattern for real like certain mother, like it just be it's so many of us so it's easy for us to be going each one of us to go at different times because it's six of us you feel me so it, anyone could just be going at that time for real like we ain't the type of niggas to get jealous when mm -hmm. one of us got the torch like, we embrace we all, that we shit we won yep. we all we feel like we won, won. If, if one of us won we all won period because the band gang name is on there at, in the front of the name period so yeah, all of us won at the end of the day yeah, okay so band gang and shred games not the same it's two, it's two separate groups two uh, separate rap groups okay how many of your artists is over there at, at shred Gang? Uh, it's uh three. Okay, but y'all are affiliated, right? 
Yes, the bad guy is the family. Shred gang, bad gang, the family. Okay. Two rap groups. Right. So how how did all y'all meet up? <coughs> shit, we grew up. We just stuck with this shit. We really like we just hubble, strive from old Mark Twain. We all from <coughs> like three blocks. Everybody. Except me. Yup. Except him. He the only one that ain't um, from the same block from every, like who we from. Yeah, where everybody else grew up for real, for real. <coughs> but we all had mutual, you feel me, friends. We all knew the same niggas, so it was always that connection. We always knew each other because we knew the same niggas. Right. Now, Big, you, you you mighty quiet, man. Like, what's <laughs> up, man? You, you, is you awake? <laughs> yeah, I'm up. Yeah, I'm so, up here so, so, so what's going on? So, so with your ankle monitor, like, you know, you said you've been on it nine months? <coughs> yeah, man. Like, how does it, you know, does it get tight on you, you know? No, I didn't get tight. I can flip that bitch around, do whatever with that bitch, move it up and down, flip it around. Shit, you know. Yeah. Shit's a bullshit. All right. And how's your, how's, you know, the, the PO officer, you know, the person you got to check on with that chillin'? Motherfucker, she mean, but she nice, because I've been dropping dirty for the whole nine months, and she ain't like me up yet, and these the feds we talking about, so. Yeah. She really nice at the same time, but she mean as hell. She can get mean for sure. Yeah, so you can't drink, smoke, none of that? No. Nah. So, like, how are you handling it, you know, you and your niggas, they smoke a lot and, and shit like that? That shit hurt, but, I mean, it's better. Because I could be up, though, you know? I ain't, you know? Shit, I could be up. Yeah. Man, that's what's up, man. So, I mean, what y'all got coming in the future? Group project. We really probably about to drop some shit called the, the new chapter of group CD. Yeah, that bitch gonna go hard. Big's campaign two coming. Yeah, big. Yeah, that bitch coming real soon, real yeah. soon. Big's campaign two. I'm gonna drop a project two. After the group uh, project and after big shit drop, I'm gonna drop a project two. It's all up. Yeah. Now, uh, about two weeks ago, I released a a, 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 a list, a Detroit list. Yeah, you had it hot. You had niggas hot here too, boy. <laughs> that was on the radio was turnt, talking about boy. that shit. The radio talked about it? Man, yeah. listen, bro. Hey, bro, you morning you, down there. Nigga, you turned the beat up on my mama, show, bro. Night show. You all had that. everybody in the studio. I love that shit when that happened, cause nigga, everybody like nigga, nigga we I'm on the way. We are going to the studio. We just got to work. Video. <laughs> we all yeah. that. It was on that day, then you had you had everybody and they feelings who ain't make the list, but it was good that that you did that though, for real though, cause yeah. it made niggas who ain't make it, it made it opened a lot of niggas eyes. You feel me? Like oh, I ain't been going hard for real. I ain't been going hard enough, so I gotta go harder, and it just made more competition for real. So why do you think the list was so big? Is it was it because the list came from somebody that wasn't from Detroit? No, it was because the list came from somebody that everybody watched. You feel me? They watched that shit like. Niggas watch that shit, so they kind of took it personal. You feel me? Like, damn, I fuck with the nigga, damn, so I gotta get on my shit. You feel me? That, like, that's how it was. They like, damn, we be looking at this shit, and we be wanting to be on this shit. And then it was, you made an actual list. So niggas sure. like, damn, we watched this shit, so, you feel me? Because yeah. if they wouldn't have never watched it, they wouldn't have knew about the list, you feel me? Right. So they, they but I mean, you know, people like Cash <laughs> Doll, they, I had her on the list, but she was still saying fuck, say cheese, and... And, and stuff like that. Like, people was on the list and still was mad, though. She was hot as hell, too. That was a hot number, too, I swear. Yeah. That was a hot Do number. you think she deserved to be that high? She she put in work. She put I ain't gonna work. lie. You damn near hit that bitch right on the nose. Yeah, for sure. Everybody, you... A lot of motherfuckers didn't read this shit. <laughs> yeah, they, they didn't did. see what you said. Tours, yeah. videos, consistency, uh, shit like shows that. Shows like, and shit. Like, you feel me? They didn't read that. For sure, And for between sure. the months, they didn't read the you time period. You bitch damn near right on the money. Yeah, they didn't yeah. read it. They just seen, a lot of people just was reposting the, the Man, list. Motherfuckers just was one, two, three, four, five, six, looking at it. They like, what? read no caption, no just caption. screenshot, repost. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. So that's how. Then they was feeling people. dumb as hell when they went back and read it, though. Yeah. Was it anybody I left? I left off. F and B D Z, like I said. Okay. He been, he been really good. Cool. I got a lot of G T too. Mm -hmm. G T. Yeah. I ain't GT gonna for lie. Sure. G T. You damn sure. could have put G T and right, and right together. together for sure. That would have mm. been a I good ain't gonna duo. Lie. They work yeah. great together. And they got a whole project together. Them niggas yeah. sound good together. Yeah. I got a lot of flack because I, you know, Filthy Rich commented and put his shit up, you know, talking oh, yeah, about yeah. it. I ain't gonna but then lie. he said Ice Ice where I missed out on him. But 
He's incarcerated, and I felt and I felt like that would have been unfair to, the people to put out. him the, right for the people that's really out doing some shit right now. You mean? Because mm-hmm. we really know what Vance yeah. did at in the city. You feel me? He one of the top. You feel me? One of the top dogs of the city for sure. Yeah. He, he do the biggest shit. He be feel me at all the big shows. So he definitely the top dog here. You feel me? Because when the shows the big shit come, he be the headliner for the D. You feel me? Yeah. So. Anything, anything, sure future, whatever. You know what I mean? Yeah, it'd be a headline. Soul concert. He, he got that motherfucker. <laughs> yeah. And I had T Grizzly number one. For sure. For sure. For sure. Okay. You see that? It's in the proof of the pudding. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, when I released it, I seen a lot of Detroit people going at each other. Like a lot of the the people who you know, who who are in the Detroit hip hop scene. They start arguing with each other. It was a lot of it was a lot of shit going on. Like, did y'all get a lot of phone calls that day? We was in the studio. <coughs> when you dropped the list, we was in the studio that morning, like for hours, too long. Uh, we had a whole little uh, block, so we really wasn't even answering the phone. But people were not people wasn't mad for real, cause we had we was on there. You feel me? So our people really weren't mad. So they really didn't call. They just was saying they was really taking up for you though, for real. Our people, cause they was saying read. You feel me? That's all they. A lot of our people posted it though, for sure. Yeah. Okay. 